Presented by AT&T, Rethink Possible. Hey everyone, I'm Kelly Wallace. Time for the hottest stories of the week on Ah Village Five. Five top Olympic moments this week. Number one, more medals than India. One of the craziest Olympic stats we have heard. Michael Phelps, with his 22 Olympic medals, now has won more medals than India has in 116 years. India, with its population of one billion. What's next for the history-making man? A new girlfriend, for starters. Number two, ratings bonanza. Sexy Ryan Lochte says he'd consider doing Dancing with the Stars. Asked whom he'd like to go up against? That's easy, his rival for nearly a decade, Michael Phelps. Lochte v. Phelps on Dancing? Lock it in, producers. It would deliver blockbuster ratings. Number three, newest star. First, the Fab Five wins Team Gold, then Gabby Douglas becomes the first African-American to win the all-around, and then Allie Raceman wins gold on floor and bronze on beam, making her the most decorated U.S. gymnast of these games. Her coach had his lucky four-leaf clover in his pocket, something he didn't have when the 18-year-old narrowly missed a medal in the all-around. And now the iVillage 5 question of the week. You'll know the answer if you've been reading my blog. Which gold medal winner spent four hours every day commuting to and from practice since she was 11? The answer in seconds. Number four, lightning bolt. Only one non-Brit has dominated the front pages here, and I think you can guess who that is. The fastest man alive, Usain Bolt, who held on to that title by winning the 100 meters race. And what a class act. He cut short an interview to pay tribute to the American national anthem as it was played for Sonia Richards-Ross, winner in the 400 meters. Number five, rare PDA. One of our favorite picks of these Olympics, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge caught celebrating with a warm hug after the Brits won a gold medal in indoor cycling. William told the BBC, I was absolutely dreading they were going to come and show myself and my wife. That would have been very embarrassing. Not at all, makes Englanders and the rest of us love them both even more. And now the answer to the iVillage 5 question of the week. Have you been reading my blog? Dana Vollmer, three-time gold medal winner in London, whose mom told us she and Dana spent four hours every day driving to and from practice because there was no indoor pool in their town. That's it for today. See you next week on iVillage 5.